Hey, I'm jumping yet? Hey, it's a break! You should mind your business. <gasps> oh! What's up guys, Kevin here. So welcome to What Would You Do? I think you guys might have heard about this TV show. So it practically, you know, peep, there are some actors and they go and do a situation and then there are other people, you know, real people like uh, normal people that aren't actors and they are actually seeing what they would do in that situation. So, uh, oh my god, the voice crack. Right. Uh, I'm gonna link down the video and all. And so, go ahead and subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell icon and give this video a big thumbs up. Right, so, the, the video that we're gonna react to today is called Nanny is Abused by Child While Mother is Not Watching. Mm. Alright, let's go. I gotta make a call. You pick something out with Alejandro. All right. Okay, mom. Wow. We'll be fine. Wow. <laughs> oh my god, did you see that look? Oh my god, I, I, I gotta see that again. All right, look at that. Something out with the mom is going. Okay, All right. mom. We'll be fine. Look at the look. The <laughs> oh my god. The, the expression just changed. It, we weren't even like 15 seconds into the video and she was already like. Oh my god. Alright, let's continue. So, how about her? This? Okay, look, me. <laughs> I already told you. I don't need Wow. Can I see something I like? I'll let you know. Whatever you want. <laughs> Shut up. Oh my god, look at this kid. Oh my god. <laughs> look at the face that I just stopped at. Oh my god. What a freaking. Wow. <laughs> Like, she was just trying to be nice and she already, whatever you want, whatever, like, what? What's wrong with you? Oh my god, she is the devil itself. <laughs> Alright. Don't be so stupid. I'm the boss. When mom's around, she is the perfect little princess. And then she becomes a when demon. When mom's away, a demanding diva comes out to play. Do you let this pint-sized prima donna abuse <laughs> no. the babysitter? Or do you stick up for a nanny in need? Yeah, me? what the heck? What would you do? Here comes my mom. You say anything, and I'll get you fired. Oh, shut up! I'm getting fired by this little... Watch your profanity. Get off. Shut up, dude. Oh my god. Everything okay, Alejandro? Oh, we're just great, Mom. I found so wow. many things I like. You're the best for bringing wow. me here. Poor Nanny, what the heck? Look. Wow. Alright, I know they're actors, but this girl is making me mad. Alright. We've taken over the toy box in Colts Neck, New Jersey. Oh this God. first shopper All right. is nearly She's frozen under in nice. place right. when she hears Amanda's rude words. Tell my mom to buy me that right now or else I'll have you fired. Oh, shut up. And do you want that to happen? No, because then you won't get anywhere in life. Uh, girl, what the heck? There are other better jobs than freaking babysitting a demon or something. What the heck? She said, then you won't get anywhere in life. Oh my god. Oh, please, shut up. Oh my god. Amanda. She struggles <laughs> with what to do. Oh god, freaking. And then. Like, you know. What, what you say? What you say? Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> what the Reluctantly, heck? she speaks up. Yeah. That was very mean what she just said to her. I mean, yeah, but she's just a nanny. She's a person, you she's idiot. She's Sorry. She's not your best Sometimes friend. I just get too much into the story that I don't even realize they're actors. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, but we're paying her. It doesn't matter. It's yeah. That's nice some respect. I mean, she's like stupid. Like, look at her just stand there. What? Amanda, I think that makes Shut up, you're just a nanny. I'm gonna come and beat you up. What? You should be respectful of your elders. Sorry. I really appreciate it. <laughs> and oh now the soft-spoken woman tells the store's manager, who's actually one of our actors, oh, yeah. how she's feeling. I'm just, you were just 
She's so deep in conversation that she doesn't see us standing by. Oh my god. And then we step in. Hi ma'am, how are you? I'm okay. I'm John Quinones. John Quinones, sir. This is what would you do? Oh my god. Okay. You were very upset, obviously. Yeah. What was going through your mind? I was going to leave and come back to the store later because I was very upset by how she was treating the nanny. You just ah, yes, I. Mm -mm. She was um, telling her that because she was a nanny, she wouldn't become anything. That's just messed right. up. Come on. We roll again. I don't need your help. I can do it on my own. Um, okay. Um, tell my mom to buy this for me, or I'll get you fired easily. She just said, uh, "I don't need your help. I'll do it on my own." And then she asked her nanny to tell her mom to buy her that. What kind of... All right, shut up. This woman quietly lends her support directly to our nanny. Hold this. <laughs> yeah, what? Yeah, that... I just don't... Oh I my just... God. Are you really going to let her treat you like that girl? What? <laughs> I don't know, like... <laughs> yeah, what the heck? Freaking annoying. Huh. <laughs> I'll, I'll try to be patient. <laughs> Yeah. But when Amanda does this, pick that up. Boy, if you don't get. You just threw the ball down and you said, pick that up. I ain't your dog. What are you doing? You pick that up yourself. Oh my god. I ain't picking that up. No. Amanda, you can pick it up. Yeah, yourself. what the heck? She changes her focus. I think you can pick that up yeah. yourself. Yeah. She gets paid to do oh, stuff. Oh, shut up. She's the nanny. She's the nanny. <laughs> yeah. And then she turns her attention to the manager. What is she saying? I don't think in this case, like, you should be talking to the manager, but even, like, if you tell that to the parent, they're gonna, you don't know what their reaction could be. They could be like, uh, the, that kind of parent that is like, you know, oh my god, how dare you talk like that, uh, like that to my daughter? Oh my god, do you know who my daughter is? Oh my god, <laughs> like I can't even believe you assumed that my daughter would be so evil. <laughs> like they could be like that. So you sh definitely know. I don't know. You should tell that to the kid, but I don't know. There's really not the not a right answer to do, right thing to do with here. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> my god. And then finally tells our mom what she saw. Oh, you can. She dropped something on the floor. Who did? The nanny? Is she scared of the kid? What's happening? Why are you whispering? She said she's picking up that's your job. <laughs> Wait. Wow. Before anyone gets fired, time for us to step hey, in. Hey, I'm jumping yet. <laughs> It's a break, bro! <laughs> I'm just like, oh my god, I don't know what to do. I just felt terrible for the nanny. Oh my god. I, just, I kept thinking, oh my god. I'm glad this was, what would you do? I don't need your help. This mom shopping All with right. her kids she keeps seems a like, close watch right. on what's happening. I keep on telling you this. I'm fine by myself. You do your thing and I'll do mine. Uh, yeah. When mom returns, Amanda tells a different story about what happened. Oh my god, the nanny was so mean to me, Mom. You. She wow. was so rude. She's not nice. I don't like her. And now the customer can't stay quiet. Of course not. <laughs> yeah, she's insane. She would say What was she saying? She's like really mean to the nanny. She just told me that the nanny was being mean to her. No. no. <laughs> Where is she going? Amanda? She's getting out of the store. What? Alejandra? Can you tell me what she's saying? Cause I'm, I just, I want to know. Before she's out the door, we. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm John Quinones. And that's why I was like pacing the store. They had already looked around the store. So what were you waiting for? An opportunity to say something? Kinda, yeah. I mean, I felt that I needed to tell the parent. Yeah, I mean that her daughter was being a certain way. You know, I can see in her face she's like, oh my gosh, like why is she talking to her like that the whole time? That's why I was. I was pacing, I'm like, just like, this is crazy. She has no respect whatsoever towards And the then name. this woman enters. Oh, she seems She's like, also shopping with her kids. She seems like, you know, the person who would actually do something about it. 
and talking on the phone. Do you want to get one of oh, those? Or? I can pick out my own things. Oh, I don't God, need no. your help. So initially, Amanda's ugly words seem to go unnoticed. All right. Why don't you understand? I'm the boss. You're just the nanny. You don't mean You're a little girl. Shut up. Just stop following me. I can get you fired if you I don't do what I tell you to do. Oh my God. So I don't think you would want that to happen. Okay, annoying us. Well, I mean, she's just she's the nanny. But that's not nice. She's Look a kid. Wait, what? She's the cameras. Famous. You have feelings too, don't what you? Mm -hmm. And imagine if somebody said that to you, that would hurt your feelings, wouldn't it? And she can't. Her job is to get me things, though. It's That's not to like, do anything. Her job is to take yeah. care of you, not to just get you things. That's not nice. With her own children <laughs> listening She's and like, looking on, the customer the continues, time. trying to teach the little diva to be a better person. Yeah. I'm telling you, I'm a mommy, and if my, if my daughter talked like that to someone that was taking care of her, I would be very, very upset with her. Mm -hmm. I would be very disappointed. But, it's not nice. <laughs> I mean, yeah, nice because that, oh, you I want guess. people to be nice to you? Mm -hmm. You want nice things in life? You need to be nice to people. She started off when Amanda me. talks back to the sympathetic shopper. She's my nanny. You should mind your business. <gasps> oh! oh my God. <laughs> she's like, uh, she's my nanny. You should mind your business. What? She came up with that comeback. Like, like what? <laughs> This girl, oh my god, oh, let's continue, wow. Puts our little girl in her place. You need to be respectful to your elders. That's what you need to learn. I'm a grown person, you're a little girl. Yeah, what? She's a grown woman. You don't talk to your elders that way. And then, uh, hey, don't get yet. <laughs> I'm John Quinones. Oh <laughs> my goodness, are you serious? Yes, they're oh actors. My god. Oh my, I'm gonna cry right now. I was so upset. I was on the phone with one of my friends oh my and I heard her speaking like that. I hung up. And I hung up. I'm like, I gotta go. I'm like, I can't. I'm like, she's a person. I'm like, that's not nice. I looked at the nanny and she had tears in her eyes and I just felt like, you know, we live in a world with so many horrible things that go on. Yeah. And this was a, a child that was talking that way and uh, it's scary. Well, the message that I try to teach I mean, my children. Usually it's not the child's fault, like it's the parents' fault, you know, that like where else should they learn to speak like that, you know, but hey, hey, we're not judging here, all right? Uh, so <laughs> uh, that was what would you do and I hope you guys enjoyed this video, I don't know. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it, give this video a big thumbs up and share it with your friends and also go ahead and subscribe to my channel and join the silver group and turn on the bell icon because I upload these videos let me try that again because I upload videos every week and uh, so I hope you guys have a good day and I'm gonna see you guys later bye